Two of Michigan's top indoor track and field performers have been throwing their weight around this winter, literally. Weight throwers Grant Cartwright and Joe Ellis have flip-flopped all season, breaking the school record, and at the Big Ten Championships went 1-2, with Cartwright taking the top podium. Oh, crowd loves it. He loves it. This is huge. Big points for Michigan. Joe and I had been talking about this for a couple of years now, you know, how we wanted to go 1-2 and two at conference. For me to win and Joe to get second, I think that was more incredible than um, my personal uh, championship. It was the fact that I was sharing it with Joe. When he has success, it reflects you know well on well on me because it's like we work together, we do those things. And when I have success, vice versa. Grant and Joe go after each other daily. <gasps> they often wrap up Thursday practices with a three try throw off to see who wins the day. You know, by the time we entered that first meet, uh, we'd had at least 12, 13, 14 mini competitions against each other for about three or four months. What happened at that meet, that was not out of the ordinary for us. All that energy in that kind of t competition, that was something that we actually practice in practice. A healthy competition, but both men see the bigger picture of their Herculean efforts. We actually talked, talked about it at the beginning of this year and we said, look, we could have ups and downs this year. You could beat me, I could beat you. We just said no matter what happens, we're going to be there for each other. We're going to be there to push each other. We're going to be there to support each other. Uh, a dog uh, defecated in our home, and uh, I was the one who had to pick it up, and I did it. Perhaps even stronger than their competitive spirit is the spirit of their friendship. They're also close friends and roommates, along with two other throwers. Well, just to give you some idea, we have... I think three refrigerators and two freezers at our house. So there's a lot of eating. There's a lot of constant eating going on. Woo! Our grill is always on. I mean, like we go through propane, like a big tank every two weeks because we cook so much food. Uh, I mean, that's generally most of our activities will, you know, circle around food of some kind. When they're not cooking and eating and going to class and practicing, they like to hang out and play video games. Everything they do on the field and off plays into the framework of a bigger goal, bigger than both of these jolly giants. It's not a desire to, to beat him. It's a desire to compete and earn as many points for the team. Because at the end of the day, the most important thing is that we're representing the team well and we're representing the coaching staff well, and we're representing the Block M well. Ponder the weight of that statement. For MGoBlue.com, I'm Ed Kingerski.